Anyway, dragon in a wagon. Let's have a look. A look at world production of dragon in a wagon. Yeah, fair enough. So this one's apparently a activity center that teaches kids about transport. Now you can't operate a, a motor vehicle, but you can learn about them at the very least. Hi there, I'm the world famous dragon transportation expert. I'm so famous, there's even a book about How me. How are you a transportation so expert? Book, <laughs> Maybe that's what it is. Maybe because he doesn't have wings and he we can't fly. He, he's had to learn about yeah, public, uh, just wait transport in general. To start any of the nifty games, just click on a picture. Yeah, okay. Um, sort of go. I think it was like, yeah, quizzes, build your own vehicle, <laughs> games relating to, um, to transport, and there's like an art center. I might leave the art center until the end. Let's, let's work our way, like, sort of clockwise. What about the book, though? What's the book let's entail? Let's read the story, Dragon in a Wagon. Oh, there's an actual story? Oh, no, that's it. Way better. Okay, so hang on. I'm going to have to turn down cycles on. Click on me. Oh, yeah, all right. No, it was actually running too fast. Yeah, no, let's let's interact. I'm I'm keen for that. Open oh hang on. You wanna let's oh okay, so that's pages, that's back to the start. You wanna read Maggie it out? Opens a word window. Guess what she sees. The hell is a word as in a window in like Microsoft Word? Is that the case? Um I don't have hotspots or anything. Okay. Yeah. Just, hang on. Hang on. Let's go back. I don't. I'm not sure if I did that right. Let's read the story "Dragon in a Wagon" by Jane Belk Moncure. Click on the book to read the story yourself. Click on me to hear the story. Okay. I guess we don't have hotspots or anything. So let's just get her to read. I guess. Megan opens a word window. A dragon in a wagon. Oh, no. Now it's... Good idea. No, <laughs> it's just... It's running way too fast and it's actually cutting off the, um... The audio and stuff. All right. Let's read the story. How, how far do you... Know? I'm going to put it right down to like 20 monster. and hopefully that'll... That'll work. Click on the book to read the story yourself. This so seems to be going Click too fast, to doesn't it? Story. Well, let's, let's read it ourselves this time. It's <laughs> just that Looney Tunes, like, big band noise. All right. Megan opens a word window. Guess what she sees. Do uh, you? Yeah. What? She. Okay, they've got individual. Opens. Um, little sound files for each word. word. That's good. All right. A dragon in a wagon. Hi, says the dragon. Let's go for a ride. Just, you didn't. It, <laughs> I know that's trying to teach us about transport. Maybe, maybe something other than a wagon. I don't know. Yeah, I'm trying to think of other words that uh, rhyme with dragon. The other one off the top of my head's like flagon. It doesn't Good even have idea, wheels. Says Megan. She hops inside, but the wagon does not go very far. So. So. Oh, they just jump Megan in the car. Megan and the dragon hop into a car. The car will not go. So they. Yeah, the petrol's expensive at the moment. It's like a dollar sixty here. I actually drove, like, two suburbs over this morning, A, to get breakfast, and B, to get, you know, cheaper fuel. All right, and a bus. Hop on a bus with a horse and a fat hippopotamus. It, okay. You're going to go see um, Miss Frizzle at school? Like, yeah, I'm a little disappointed there's no hotspots or anything. That's, that's a little lazy. I've been sport with living books, though. The bus though. will not go. So they... Is this, is this me in animal form? Is this my fursona? <laughs> it's the hippo in the driver's outfit. Jump into a boat with a dog... Still haven't shifted weight from um, Christmas either. I've been trying to get... I've been trying to bloody um, just jump on the bike and watch some anime. I've been the slack. Will not float. It's been a bit too hot. We had it, It's nowhere near as bad as um, last week. Last week it was just muggy as. At least now it's kind of gone back to a dry heat. Hop on a sled with a moose who has five bunny mice on his head. Oh, it's sort of teaching basic counting as well from the looks of that too. The sled will not go, so they... You'd think maybe, um... Yeah, maybe stop overloading your transportation? A cow, three pigs, a hen... 
man and a duck. No, no, they're not learning. No. The truck will not go. <laughs> so they. <laughs> what do they do next? Oh. On a train with an elephant. Well, choose the elephant the first. That'd be your first problem if you're having a weight issue. Jesus. Yep. The train will not go, <laughs> and it starts to. Oh come on! One carriage holds a fair bit of livestock. Like the cow's fine. It's at least set up for the cow. Okay. Rain, so they hop off the train. Oh, this thing's gonna rain. drop out of the sky and fucking embed like a dart, isn't it? Yep. The plane will <laughs> not fly. Like, why are you so putting all this weight on me? Why? Float in the sky. Oh, like parachutes. Yeah, yeah all right. Super. Individual parachutes will, um, will help them a bit. Okay. Um. I don't know, says Megan, but we'll be there soon. Yeah, just quick, quick trip to the ground, sure. As soon as they land, they find a balloon. Yeah, okay. We says the dragon, let's fly to the Don't moon. We in let's the basket keep going, and fly to a star. Yeah, you want to fly all the way to the star with this basket sinking a piss? Yeah, righto, dragon, righto. Oh no, says Megan, I will not go that far. You don't want to read the rest of that? Oh no, says Megan. I will not go that far. I think we should yeah, stop. Yeah, there we go. Do you see where we are? Oh, we're at, um, yeah. <laughs> That's a weird parade float. Megan waves to a clown Plan and a girl and his on giant a swing. Pants. But then... Hmm, what happens then? The dragon finds his favorite thing. Oh, he just Come got an along, upgraded wagon. Says the dragon as okay. he rides away. Yeah, right. Eh? No, thank you, says Megan. No more rides today. Goodbye, dragon in a wagon. Yeah, you, you, you're supposed to be teaching us about transport, but you're not very good at it, Mr. Uh -huh. Dragon. Okay. Well, we at least I, I was, wasn't expecting a story. We got a story at the very least. Right, no more stories for us, though. Okay, Help we'll try some activities. The line. Crossroad puzzle. You're just in time to start working on the puzzle. This isn't just any puzzle; it's a crossroad puzzle. Fill in all the empty spaces with the right vehicles or terrains. The vehicles go on top in the ovals, and the terrains go on the bottom in the oh, puzzle. Oh, okay. No, that's straightforward. Yeah. All right. Okay. Um. So what you have to slot. Yep, you have your sled for the um, icy bit. You obviously have a Sailboat. boat for the boat, um, for the water. Plane Airplane. for the sky. Train for Train. the track. Yep. Car. Uh, for that. And we just hit this. Oh! Here we go to another oh, game. we don't even get any animation or anything? What are, what are these two? Oh, this is just Are you more... ready for a new challenge? Oh, righto, righto. So it just ups the difficulty this time. Yeah, right. You must really want a challenge. Yeah, yeah, I kind of do actually. Sky. Um, can we stuff it up? Mountain bike. Can we just put the wrong thing in there. Tall grass. Oh, grass. I probably need a, a horse for horse? that, I imagine. Okay, so you can't fit everything in. Snow. Um. Snow more. We'll get a couple of these right at least. Pond. Probably here. Actual Rowboat. boat. Sidewalk. Probably the wagon. Yep. Tracks. And rail car. Rail car. Let's give this Hang game on a try. Around. I was I was hoping it like and it, uh, yeah I don't I'm pretty sure I didn't get up that all right. Fill in all the spaces, then we can see if. It oh, works. okay, okay. I see what we're doing. All right. Sky. We'll put in all the Snow. pieces. Tra Oop. Yeah, I was hoping to at least get some animation on this or something. Um, okay, so we'll get one wrong again. That's what you need, the mountains. Jeep. Um, can we do a jeep on anything? Motorboat? Yeah, they'll get through that. Airplane. Um, yeah. Sled. What else we got? Helicopter? Um no. Rail Oop, rail car. Rail car. Um oh grass though. Jeep, jeep. I guess. And just normal car. car for road. Let's see if it works. Mountain bike in the sky. Oh, you do Oops, get animations. That doesn't work. Oh, Let's she see doesn't. If we can fix this track so it'll run to the end. Okay. Helicopter. 
We'll swap it out and we'll do it properly. Helicopter? In the sky! I don't know what the um stars indicate. Oh no, we get two two stars for each correct one. Okay. On the track. That looks like hard work. Motorboat? In the pond. Jeep. In the tall grass. Okay. Car. On the road. Yeah, okay. Great. You got all 12 stars. I was kind of hoping they'd have animations for when you fuck it up, though, but yeah, that's you good enough. You mastered that in no time. Yeah, if you want to go to a new puzzle, click on the flashing arrow. Yeah, give us one more. Here we go to a new right. We'll probably get the same thing. I'll try and get different um, vehicles this time just to show it off. Can you fit in there properly? Thank you. Ocean. Ocean. Sky. Snow. All right, so sled for the snow. Um, car for the road. Rail car. No, we won't. We'll get a proper train for the track. Uh, Jeep, we kind of did. Maybe mountain, mountain bike. bike for the grass. Uh, sailboat for the ocean. And airplane. airplane for the sky. Let's see if that worked. Car! On the road! <clears throat> Excuse me. On the tracks! Yeah, I can't get over that. Like, I've got the cycles down to like 20%, and it's still running a little bit too fast. In the ocean! Mm hmm. Airplane. <laughs> I wanted to the see sky. the sailboat, like, yeah, just, Snowmobile. Yeah, just fall off. On the snow. Okay. Well, that's Way good enough for go. activities. All 12 stars. Yippee! Yeah. Oh, we, we know our transportation, apparently. Okay. Um, oh, except it's going to crash on me. Don't crash. Yeah, even, even like my, no, no, hang on. Oh. There's a matey, don't I? It's gonna fuck up, matey. I've been having a lot of problems on stream today. Yep, we're gonna have... There we go. Drop frames. Don't forget Ho in the glory hole, by. Oh, no, sorry. We'll get, we'll get the Japanese chick to read it out for us. I can't wait till next time. Open sun. Don't forget to point the glory hole. Yeah. Nice. Thanks for that, matey. Um... Indeed shenanigans, yeah. Yeah, some I, I think it's just the heat. The heat's just making my computer run shit. It's time for the quiz show. Oh uh, Okay. Transportation quiz show. Mm -hmm. Thanks mm -hmm. for joining right. us in the Dragon's Transportation Quiz Show. Now, here's your host, the Dragon. Hello there! I'll ask the questions and hopefully you'll have the answers. Are you ready for some fun? Okay, yeah. let's get the game started. Click on a star to get the game rolling. Okay, is it like Hollywood Squares or something like that? Which vehicle is a jet ski? Oh, that's slack. Oh, kids might know, not know what this is anymore. The old um, Concorde. Yeah, they went out of business a long time ago. Oh. Um, yeah, that's a jet nice ski. Try. Oh, it just gets rid of the thing. Okay, you just click the right answer. Good work. Jet ski. Very, very pink jet ski, that's for sure. Which vehicle is a motorcycle? Yeah, right. That's right, motorcycle. We're going to bump the difficulty up on that. Oh, we're getting a um, a, we're either getting a picture or a quick time movie. Which vehicle is a jet ski? Fire truck. Who rides a horse? Well, well, everyone here can ride a horse. It's not that hard. It's got to be the sea captain, surely. It's got to be my my grandfather. You think that it would be it, but it's not. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, the yeah, the World War One pilot, sure. Pick another answer. Yep. Uh, no, it's a, it's fireman. Fireman ride horses. That's so just wrap the hose around the horse. I uh, just cowboy, I suppose. You're learning fast. A cowboy, cowboy has a tiny head, though. <laughs> or maybe a big hat. I don't know. Which vehicle is a cruise ship? Oh, okay. Terrific cruise ship. <laughs> Oh, we get a, we get a, oh, someone's going to crash at this air show, I'm sure. Which vehicle is a tugboat? <laughs> Did this dragon motherfucker just use, you think you do, but you don't whine? He does. He's, he's a little patronizing, this boy. Um, yeah, that, this is, this is the boat that tugs. You mastered that in no time. Tugboat. And he's being like, you know, he's pra praising us a little too much for getting it right. Which bicycle is good for going over rocky paths? 
<laughs> it's a tricycle troll. You think that it would be it, but it's not. Yeah, yeah. No, he's just he's just being patronizing. Well these oh no, that's more of a road bike that one, isn't it? Hey, excellent. The mountain bike. Mountain bike. Okay. And yeah, I, I definitely shouldn't have gotten that one wrong considering I work in a in a bike warehouse. Who uses a fire engine? Oh surely the, the motorbike. Is <laughs> this what is this? It's a, I'm I'm going guessing from the armor plating and stuff, he's like a BMX rider. He looks like a spaceman. Pick an answer. Did you fucking settle down, dragon? Just, uh, just let me pick. You're very good, firefighter. You're patronizing me, bastard. All right, hang on. Which vehicle is a hot air balloon? Oh, probably the one shaped like a balloon. I don't know. Sensational, hot air balloon. I'm, I'm eager to see what he's got for me for the um the super hard one. Which vehicle uses animal power? Um, oh, probably the dog sled. Yeah. Sharp. <laughs> You're sled. so good at this. You wow. You them all. What a great job. And we don't even get a video or anything. It's just to yeah, start a new crappy game. little picture. Click on the flashing new game button. No, I want to do. I want to go hardcore on this one. All right. What plane goes faster? Oh, it is a little trickier. Sound. Okay. Yeah, it will probably be the um, the Concord jet. Yeah, I can't remember what why they went. I I think they were just too overpriced. But it was it was a Which super fast plane. It, it was like across the Atlantic in an hour or something. Superb, Concord. But yeah, no, they were just sort of yeah, they're just too pricey. What should always be worn when you ride a bicycle? <laughs> You got the answer for that wrong. It's clearly my hand went flapping. <laughs> Just the whole cracking of the sand. What? Yeah. Pick an answer. The crack of you breaking the sand barrier when you get to the end of it. You got to do the slow build up too, don't you? Um. Yeah. Car battery. That's so close. <laughs> yeah. You electrocute yourself and light comes out of your eyes. Isn't that how it works in cartoons? If why would you wear a log though? Seriously. <laughs> You're right. Helmet. Oh dear. What what picture are we revealing, by the way? Which no vehicle is powered by an engine. Yeah, probably the old sled. You're right on target. Snowmobile. I'm going off that. I know it's called a snowmobile, but yeah, apparently in Canada they're just called sleds. And um, because I'm Australian and love to shorten everything, I'm just going with sleds. Wow, a picture. I wonder what the rest of it looks like. <laughs> Shut up, dragon. You wear the log for ramming, Ovi. Yeah, yeah, you put it under what the arm the and you, you siege the castle. Cows off the train tracks. Oh, it was probably the actual shovel bit. Right on! Yeah, cow those, those cows didn't want to move. <laughs> Which wheels of the train oh, it's just all the train track wheels. ones. Um, probably the ones attached to the engine. You're learning fast! Driving wheels. Okay, this is a little trickier for the kids, I suppose. Which type of aircraft uses a runway? Well, yeah, not the seaplane, obviously, and not the balloon. You, you do have a little bit of a runway to start, you know, the hang gliding. Which you get a little bit of a run. Just settle down. Yeah, it's probably the actual jet plane. Excellent. Jet plane. Okay. And, uh, I like uh, yeah the um oh the car tells you how it, fast you're hang going. on hang on as if a fucking kid's gonna know how the inside of a car works they just get the parents to drive they're not they're never sitting in the driver's seat but it's probably your speedo I imagine beautiful work speedometer mm -hmm, mm -hmm. okay oh we we've revealed horses that's what we're revealing that plane okay. is not allowed to fly over countries because it's so loud ah uh, that was the other thing with concord wasn't it um that's yes right. cuz it broke the sand barrier it was too loud so you could only go um over oceans like just yeah it couldn't go cross country on it probably another reason why it failed which aircraft is heavier than air oh uh yeah probably the uh the not balloon. You're really talented. Heli chopper. Helicopter. You got them all. <laughs> you are a true transportation. This is expert. your reward for doing these like super hard um, trivia questions.
Yeah, like, I guess it's teaching kids how to do it right, but I want another go at this. I'm eager to see what other questions were in here. Let's. <laughs> what material did early adjustments As if kids would know with? this shit as well. Yeah, I, like, I know it's. <laughs> Is this just rocks? That's. That's. That's not it. Let's try again. Yeah, it's just, it's definitely rock, not rocks. Rocks do not float. Good answer, but wrong. Yeah, and they couldn't use wood because there was no real wood in the desert. So you use reeds. Good thinking. Reed. <laughs> <laughs> it's rem reminded me of that other game we played with the, um, the chair that lets you have a baby, the, the, the birthing chair that I affectionately called the baby shit. Which kind of dog is used in a dog sled team? Yeah, probably the, um... <laughs> yeah, this dragon is an asshole, and the difficulty varies wildly. What animal does a cow make? What's the correct intermix ratio in order to attain a stable altitude while piloting a Cessna? Yeah, <laughs> no right. Um, no, my mum's got two of these dogs, but yeah, probably, probably the husky. You got it! Siberian really husky. badly drawn Siberian husky, by the way. Okay. Which part of the boat is the starboard? Uh, probably the right-hand side. Yeah, like this. Good work. Starboard. Not every kid owns a fucking motorboat either, or any kind of sailing craft. Which animal is better suited for running fast? Uh, I don't know. Uh, yeah, no, camp horse is better on speed overall, isn't it? Your brain is geared up today. Like horse. camel can go probably faster on, in like deserts and stuff, just because the way the hooves are set up. Which train? Oh no, they don't have hooves, do they? They have like feet that hour. spread out a little bit, so they uh, actually can stay a bit stable in, in the on the sand. If you had a dog sled team of schnauzers, literally the first thing they saw, they um literally the answer. first thing. <laughs> fuck up, dragon! Seriously, um, if you had a dog sled team of schnauzers, literally the first thing they saw, they fight to death with tough little scrap of asses. My old dog was a schnauzer. Oh, that's cute. Yeah, no, schnauzers are all right. Which I've answer do you around. think it is? Um, probably the electric train car. You're right! Electric <laughs> train! <laughs> I, I've ridden a lot of electric trains in Melbourne and none of them go at 150 k's an hour. Oh, miles per hour. No fucking way. What kind of aircraft was the first passenger aircraft? Yeah, there's not many that go that. Like, maybe, I know that Shinkansen in Japan goes at like 300 miles. 150, yeah, nah. Yeah, nah. <laughs> Too, ma too much actual traffic in the way. Like, we've spent years in Melbourne trying to get out, get rid of all the bloody level crossings. Still hasn't happened yet. Yeah, it's bullet train shit. Hindenburg was the first passenger, passenger aircraft, you reckon? Okay. Wow! Blimp! Oh, maybe they couldn't call it the Hindenburg for legal reasons? Just blimp? Okay. What kind of vehicle did Or- Oh. Apparently when I hit, um page down for my mute to uh, stop the thing okay um what did maybe a bike are yeah. you sure you're not in college yeah i know they're usually Bicycle. called blimps but there's got to be you do like you said you're talking about the first passion vehicle which was the hindenburg like just call it the hindenburg but if you want to be accurate what is the car's major source of power <laughs> flintstone cars run on feet no, but yeah, I learned that blimps were the first passion aircraft because of Indiana Jones. Oh, there you go. Okay. And they You're still really went on talented. with it despite it, you Engine. know, crashing and exploding. <laughs> and journalists using, oh god, the humanity for like everything what part of terrible the that happens the in uh, disasters. Uh, bow. Probably the front. That's great. Bow. <laughs> Yay! Now we can see the whole picture. <laughs> Oh, that's like those um, 30s cars that are meant to go super fast, isn't it? Yes, who knew that hydrogen was highly farmable? Such a mystery. Thanks for joining us. We'll what was it, hydrogen on the Hindenburg or was it helium? Because I vaguely remember it. No, that's right. No, a lot of them did use hydrogen too. Okay, um, let's build our own vehicle, I guess. Let's make some vehicles and see them go. Oh, this should be fun. Welcome to the body shop. Here you get to be the mechanic. This game is so great. You just have to click on the part and put it on the blueprint where it belongs. Oh, so it's just a jigsaw puzzle. Oh, that's disappointing. Oh, okay, okay. So you can do normal stuff and then bump it up and do weird ones, I guess. Toot toot! Here comes the trains! 
Ah, uh, okay. So we get a custom one as well. Let's let's do a normal one first. I can't wait to see this one when you're the done. The true irony was the smoker's lander on the Hindenburg. Yes, this is true. Landing gear. Mm -hmm. Who would have thought that'd be dangerous jet. for um for people? Wing jet. Yeah, you want to get a like. People don't really know how wings look from the sides. Landing gear. Okay. Nose. What sort of passenger area? Oh yeah, it just goes straight over the top of the wing. Yeah, Tail sure. Fin. Great job. Kerbal Let's Space Program. This is not. Do we get to? Oh, we. Oh shit! That was loud in my ears. Fucking yeah! Get out of here! You were very loud. All right, now let's try a let's try a Nifty custom one. Train parts. So we just put our own thing together, sort of. We got trains, what boats. Nifty boat parts. Oh, we gotta we gotta make some sort of like steam powered Neato airplane. Parts. Okay, hang on. Put Passenger a, area. Put on a fuselage. Watch out! Um, Here are the big trucks. Yeah. Top. <laughs> put a big big rig thing on there. Um. Animals. That's the way people Oh, we used can to scroll run. through the um the thing. Okay. Well, let's put on Front some elephant legs. legs. Yep. Uh -huh. Mind legs. Beautiful. This this is looking like a you know, this is this thing's you know, yeah. We're making hey, an all terrain vehicle. Parts. Yep. You gotta you gotta put paddle a wheel. <laughs> put a paddle wheel on it. Um, uh, maybe a boat Sturge. back for stability. Um, what about the front? Bikes are great. Oh, push bike parts. Yeah. <laughs> the little handlebars. Um, disproportionate, but anyway. <laughs> And oh, Nifty there's some, um, parts. yeah, we'll put a sled front. front on that one. There we go. And so does, does this thing actually run? I'm telling you, you're a true Apparently it does. <laughs> it doesn't go anyway because the, um, <laughs> the legs can't move. Oh, no, there it goes. <laughs> all right, now that was pretty cool. You have to use the arrows to find all the pieces for it. Oh, uh, what? You, oh, can you on. put this together? Oh, right, right, right. You search for all the pieces and build it. Ah, oh, okay. So you can do like a bit of everything, but with a set, and just put all the Bow. pieces together. Oh, okay, no, that's that's a little more complicated than what I was expecting. Front okay. Tread. Yeah, no, that looks outboard motor though. No, that that's not gonna fit. Um, what else? Oh, yeah, the treads. Um, treads. Yep. So this is a snowbound um paddle steamer. Yeah, right. Huh? Metal. Okay. Oh, you gotta have your flag, flag. too. All right. Um. Do do do. Yep. Stern. Flag. Fun fact about the Hindenburg, though: sixty-one people actually survived compared to the thirty-six deaths. Oh wow. Flag. Yeah, that's fair enough. Yeah, maybe um, because the explosion happened inside the actual balloon part, didn't it? The passenger thing was on the bottom, so maybe the the membrane of the um the balloon itself kind of You're shielded so them a bit and it, all the explosion finish. would have gone upwards because it was igniting um hydrogen too yeah that makes sense okay yeah right smokestack good work nice you're gonna you're gonna boot it up and see how this thing runs yeah there we go nice yeah i did that too i ended up watching um zulu uh the night before um pretty good movie I've been enjoying, like, your manly kind of movies on occasion, and yeah, that one did pretty well. Had, like, yeah, I think it was Michael Caine's first role, and it had, um, Calibos from Clash of the Titans. Also, why the reason why it was filled with hydrogen as Flip opposed to helium was because of U.S. export blueprint. restrictions on helium to Germany. Oh, okay. There you go. Yeah, yeah, it probably wouldn't have been super safe to, um, transport either, I guess. Oh, uh, maybe, yeah, because they wouldn't have had, I don't know if they would have had, like, you know, compressed gas technology back then either. Yeah, I, I might even do some research on the Hindenburg and the uh, see, what, see what the deal was. Well, there nose. you go. All right, put a nose on that. More more tire treads. Um, tank Tread. treads, I should say. Um, what are the other bits? Oh, yeah. Exhaust. Put a big truck exhaust on that, sure. Tail um, jet. Doesn't look like the actual tail. I remember seeing ads for Zulu back in the nineties. Yeah, yeah, it was good. Passenger um, area. Like, because it was the sixties, the actual combat wasn't super exciting. I remember seeing a soldier getting stabbed by a guy, and he's like, "Oh, ah, 
but it, it kind of ramped up as the um the Zulus kind of so far. started hitting them a bit harder. But uh, yeah, no, it was it was pretty good. Shovel. I enjoyed it. Good um good cinematography, like really nice shots of um Africa and shit. But uh, yeah, that was good. Well, that's, I've been stabbed. Oh. Yeah, yeah, there was some very British um stiff upper lip kind of stuff in it too. Like they they start you know shooting at the Zulus, just doing yeah first volley, wait for my signal, fire second volley, fire, and then it's like independent shooting, fire at will, and it, there's fire like a little fun. contingent of um, Welsh soldiers in the group, and one of them turns to the other and he's like, well that was nice of him. <laughs> I just pissed myself off at that. Try your hand at building. But yeah, no, it was good. And yeah, that was kind of the significance of it too, because um, I think it was like 130 British soldiers versus about 5,000 Zulus. Oh, okay. Make a path, but don't hit up the skunk. Yeah, right. Oh, and we just make our own thing? Okay. This, this kind of makes it easy though. Just putting your own little path in there. Um, okay. And... Yeah, all right. It's simple. Oh, Start okay. Oh, you get marker, to pick. Then okay, okay. Then at the red marker. Make sure you avoid the traffic light. Oh, okay. Oh, we got to go the long way on this one. Okay, hang on. Yeah, right. Eh? So we'll go up and around here, I suppose. Yeah, it just... And, and this, like... I, I know they're trying to do a lot with the UI, but it just seems, like, a little cluttered to me. That's all right. Well, um... Yeah, I, ju I just want to see this car running. Um, right, so we go... Yep, road all the way that way. And <laughs> OBS or Windows is um, thingo playing up again. Make sure to avoid the traffic light. What? Yep, no, I've got drop frames. Like, everything's frozen on my end, I'm afraid. Oh, that's annoying. Ah. Uh... Yep, I, I'm, I'm just going to put it down to the heat. Maybe, you know, open it up, give my um, give my fans a clean or something. Oh yeah, there we go. Oh wow, you've got actual... I guess you... I want to see if there's animations for um, running into this stuff though. Hey. <laughs> statue waves you at him. Are a puzzle master. Yeah, great. Okay. Yeah, no, I want to I wanna run this into a... Um, Thing, you know, if I can. You can't put a piece over that. Ah, oh, you can't put them over. All right. I'm glad this is teaching kids to avoid traffic lights like the plague. Yeah. Whoops! That oh, it just stops. Right. Why don't you try it again? Yeah, right. Next, we'll be teaching them to run into the street without looking. Yeah, because we got the other um, transport options here. All right. So let's um, we'll bump up the difficulty. Start your path at the green marker. Go to the school. And end at the red marker. Make sure. Oh, okay. Three. So you do the um. Can you put a put one over the um river though? That piece can't go there. Well, how the hell am I supposed to get over the river? Oh, we've got other parts. Ah, uh, righto, righto. No, is that a bridge though? Is this one a bridge? Oh, okay, that's a bridge. What's what's this one entail though? Hang on. These road pieces need to be put together, and I know you're the person for the job. Oh, do we get... Okay, we got... Oh, we just make our own one with that one. You can put in... Yeah, all right. No, that's a pretty in-depth. We'll do Start one... Your path at the don't green one marker. more. Go to and the then we'll... Um, school. I want to try the horse the one and see what the marker. horse one entails. Make sure you avoid the trees. Yeah, yeah. Avoid the trees. Blah, blah. Avoid the stop signs. Just... <laughs> it's, it's teaching... No, it's teaching kids, um, you know, traffic infrastructure. It's how to teach... It's teaching you how to build the road around the obstacles yeah that's that's fair okay and i should be able to do this quicker because i'm not too bad at um pipe dream either i'm disappointed that they didn't expect you to play segments of river for the boat to go through yeah this is true all right through the school great work yeah. amazing you finished the path okay yay 
we're good at town planning. Yeah, I, I should be great at this because one of my f other favorite games is um, Transport Tycoon. I can love that as Start a kid. Start your path at the green marker. Go to the log cabin to visit log a cabin? friend. Go to the barn for the horse to eat some hay. And end at the red marker. Oh, okay. You'll have to go around the field. Yeah, fair enough. Um, I, I don't have any friends that live in log cabins, so though. This is um, usually a little bit creepy. Good we, we avoid the skunk, though. Yeah, this is... <laughs> we have to organize the road to avoid the skunk. Yeah, sure. Um, all right, so we'll probably have to go up and around this way um, and put in some curvy curves. Curvy curve. One there. And... Um, Oh, just the log bridge to get over the river. Yeah, right. Um, and just probably another straight up here. Beautiful. All right, let's see if that works. <laughs> There's a wide horse. Yep, <laughs> it's going to eat that other horse for strength. Did they put in a little stink animation on that skunk, that though? <laughs> Go to the cabin to meet a friend. Read the Necronomicon, and then flee to the barn, then escape to the evacuation point. <laughs> now this is kind of cool. All right, now this is a little more in-depth than what I was expecting. What's the painting thing in Tell Oh, we just, this skips us straight to the art center. No, I don't want to. Oh, and we can use, oh, that's cool, though. We can use our little template. So I can technically, you know, puts in put in some stink lines on this uh, skunk here. All right, no, I was going to leave the art center to last. Oh, there's no, that's the undo button, apparently. Just a, a sick little emoji. Okay. All right, so what was... Oh, no, the, we are actually up to the art center. Okay. Have a good time in the well, we'll do a center. little bit of art and then <laughs> paint a dick on it. Yeah. Um, no, we've got, like, stickers and stuff from the looks of things here. Um, no help or anything, though. Um, okay, screenshot print i don't know oh we get our backgrounds at least okay we're getting backgrounds we get animal stamps yeah um toys vehicles vehicles characters text um oh and we get like magic markers pencils paintbrush yeah righto and the fill tool okay um so yeah we obviously got to paint it what are we going to paint I might do a, a background first. Um, yeah, I'm liking this little urban environment here. Is there more than stuff to do though? No, just the urban one. All right. Um, so I'll have like an urban environment. Um, I'll put in some, um, can we scroll through these? Is there more to choose from or just MS Paint for kids, love it. Yeah, some of these were bloody in depth. Like we still have to play the, um, the Spider-Man Movie Maker one, which I was fond of as a kid. Um, no, that's all we get for animals, though. Um, all right, we'll have a we'll put in a happy little turtle, I guess. Um, put a cat trying to hunt the turtle. Yeah, okay, it goes over the background. That's good. So I, I'm just wondering if you have to do that though, like fill tool your background before you paint anything. Oh shit! No, that's not what we wanted. <laughs> That was a little too urban on that environment. Is that... So they didn't even bother to, like, fill in the gaps on the... Oh, no, that's that's kind of terrible, actually. Um, yeah, right, well, we can paint... Oh, God. <laughs> um, paint in the lines, at least. No, that didn't work either. Oh, that's... Okay, now that's poor programming right there. And I'm just... Hang on, does it work if I... Yeah, I don't know where the center point on the little fill tool icon is either. Yeah, that's annoying. <laughs> you saw a red door and you want to paint it black. Yes. Yeah, let's let's do that. Let's let's fill in this door. Yep, don't like the red door. I see a red door and I want to paint it black. No colors anymore. I want them to turn black. <laughs> I see the girls walk by dressed in their summer clothes. <laughs> and I have to turn my head away until my darkness goes. 
Oh, uh, good inspiration, mate. He fucking did a fucking good stone song. That is for damn sure. So can we even fill in... Okay, no, we can fill in the buildings. Maybe like orangey brown for the brick. Oh, yeah, that kind of works. Um, <laughs> 10 out of 10, yeah. <laughs> um, Probably some nice beige windows, maybe. Yeah, just color this in. That's, I, I didn't really see anything exciting for um oh we gotta hang on <laughs> can we do oh no it was kind of I, I need like a larger vehicle to look like it's running them over oh that's disappointing yeah all right <laughs> this is the urban relocation um all right so we just <clears throat> oh i gotta stop doing testy blats i'm suspecting that the final line of the road because it's not fully connected it counts as not having a separate segment for the rest of the painting. Yeah, that might be it too. Yeah, yep. Yeah. Because if we go... Can we do... Is it going to colour in... Okay, it's not colouring in the um, the characters we put in. It'll do that part. Yeah, okay. Yeah, this is... Um... Yeah, yep. Yeah, no, we're not over on that one. I think it's the little... No, that doesn't work either. Okay. Um, we'll paint in some, put some grass over here, I guess. No, that's, that doesn't work at all. Really? Yeah. So, and I can see that. Like, I can see that most of the lines are connected. It's just really shitty programming on the, um, for the fill tool. Hmm. Okay. Probably do a little, we'll <laughs> just color in what we can and with the fill tool and maybe just manually do it with the, the keys. Um, we can get plenty of paints to choose from at least. Yeah, we'll make some SJW hair for the girl. Why not? And we got like flesh color there. It's J Ank. It is indeed J Ank. Um, yeah, we'll, <laughs> we'll make it like emo and shit. Um, flashy red pants. Go brown on that. Probably, what do we have? Flesh color there. Yep. Yeah, maybe if we fill in more colours, it might, um... No, no, that's not going to work at all. Okay. That's... Yeah, that's... That's, <laughs> that's a little harsh, yeah. Um... Oh, God, no. Hang on. Emos aren't half as bad as purple hair SJWs. Yeah, no, they still give me the shits. I still see them hanging around at, um... What was it? Flinders Street Station. Yeah, this this fill tool is terrible. This is a uh, this is horrible. Well, it's... <laughs> we can get a black cat at least. Um, now we'll make this we'll make this Ronnie. I'll try and do him up in proper colors. Can we at least? Okay, we can at least paint the turtle green. I'll maybe put in yellow. Yeah, that's so weird that the fill tool's working for the characters, just not the the background itself. It's it's a little annoying. Okay. Yep. Proper green turtle. Uh-huh. Um, can we at least do orange? No, the fill tool didn't. No, no. Okay, okay. Kind of worked on Ronnie. And can we just draw in some... Um, because he's a tabby. Let's draw in some little stripes. There we go. He's got a little... There we go. A little fluffy tail. Maybe if you fill in the lines at the edge, it'd work. With the pencil. Ah, oh, that's a, yeah, that's actually a good idea. We'll try that. Um, I don't know if it's gonna. Yeah, let's 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 test it. Let's draw a little thing with the uh, pencil, and then do. Yeah, that works. Okay. And no, that actually worked too. All right, no, good thinking, mate. Good thinking. We now have yeah a road with a a white road with a pothole on it. Okay. Um. Well, nice and grey on that. No, okay. Um, where do we put the, um, where do we draw the line? Maybe, maybe over here somewhere. Yeah, maybe, yeah, sort of like fill it in like that. See if that works. I'm kind of going out of the lines a bit. Kind of terrible at that. A little annoying with the, um, the sound effects too. All right, um, grey. No, that didn't work. Yeah, it, it it seems like 
Yeah, maybe because this line's not filled in and there's like a little extra it's trying to fill the rest of it. Hang on, if I do the... Do like a little grey line up here, that might keep it in place. Can't, doesn't seem like we can change the thickness on the brush either. Yeah, left vertical line on the left edge. All right. Right horizontal line at the top right. Okay. Um... Oh, no, nah, didn't quite fill that bit in. All right. So fill tool, gray. Yeah, that worked. Beautiful. All right, so can we do the same thing with the... Um... No, okay. So I've got to do the same thing again with the grass. Yeah. Fill in a bit on the side there. Yeah, that is just terrible programming, isn't it? Um, hang on. And fill this line in all the way. That should hopefully work. Yeah, there we go. Beautiful. All right, and yeah, I don't know what else we can have for the um, sidewalk. No, the sidewalk didn't work. Um. Well, oh yeah, we're gonna try and fill in some lines. On the... Yeah. All right. All right. No, I think you're right with the um doing these edges. And put in a little bit on the edge. Clearly the programmer was on a deadline and just thought she'd be right with the autofill requiring a closed segment. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I mean, quality-wise, they did okay with the um, the rest of it too, didn't they? All right. No, that sort of worked, I guess. And then we got... And it's, yeah, it's weird that it's registering the um, the background characters. Is um like where the line actually stops. Okay, now that hmm, this is this is just annoying me now because I I did want to kind of fill in the picture if I could. Um, maybe light green because it's yeah. No, that'll do. I I I, <laughs> I want to move on to this this next game, which may or may not be high quality because it's another Gigabone Gang one. Um. That'll do. <laughs> we saw it. We saw some lines. Oh, it hit the road again with the black, you reckon? Okay. Yeah, all right. No, that, that sort of worked. That didn't. Um. Oh, oh, we get an actual... What's the vacuum cleaner in Tal, though? Oh! All my years in Emma's Pain are coming in handy. Okay, the vacuum just gets rid of all the color. That is not what we wanted. Let's undo that. Um, no, I'm happy with that. It's, we'll make that the thumbnail or something, my half ass little painting project. But yeah, no, we've been at this like 45 minutes, so we're going to move on. This is, I, I still love these buttons. Just stop. Thanks for playing with us. We'll see you next time. No, you won't. You really won't. I'm watching Death Sandals video, by the way. That's that's who the, the person is. So if you want to watch a full playthrough, Death, Death Sandals.